So in this video, we'll be creating a 360 animation on Crow 3D, like what you can see on my screen. So let's begin. So this is a design I want to animate in 360. So first of all, I will set the camera angle by clicking on two. I'll just tap on two on the keyboard. So this is it. Then click on render. Then image render. So that I can see any necessary adjustments you are making. Also, the 360 um, animation can also be called, it's called turntable in Google 3D. So click on image properties or video properties. Yeah, make sure it's on turntable. Then you have to adjust the image count to 360. So the more the image count, the smoother the simulation or the animation, sorry. So 360 portraits. You can set your pixel, your image size, any necessary to change background color. And also the five parts where you want this image to <coughs> to be saved. Or well, me, I'm saving my own in an image format. You can also click on save video, then you can adjust the duration of the video, probably 10 seconds. And I'm sure if you're increasing the duration, you want to also increase the image count to for smoother simulation. So I'll be animation, sorry. Then the next thing you can do, you can also tamper with the lightning or adjust the lightning based on your taste. Well, I'll probably be done before the other. So this is it. As you can see. So you can play with the lightning here. Then but I'm going with the default lightning. So the next thing you do is to click on this pause. This is pause render. Then click on final render as image or video. So this is what you do. So let's keep, as you can see, it's rendering. So let's keep to the results. Thank you for watching this video from Tony the Creator. Don't forget to click on the subscribe button. And also, you can check my description box or visit my channel page for tutorial or beginner tutorials on how to use um, Crow 3D. Stay tuned for more animation videos.